Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today we are gonna be trying out this. This is the five in one hot air styler. So I found this as a dupe for the Dyson Whirl hair curler thing. So this I got off of a website. It was $115 and we're gonna try it out. So came in this little thing and I'm gonna read everything off to you guys. So this is the cool tip uh, curlers. So you put the hair around it and it's supposed to like whirl it around and heat up. So I have two of them. Right here. I'm gonna just set them on the table right here. And I have the blow attachment this is a blower attachment so maybe this is a hair dryer i do not know we will find out then this is the uh curler brush which is just like a little spiky thing now i will tell you i am not into hair care very much i mean you guys see my hair pulled back pretty much all the time so we are just going to get into it so this is the multi-function brush just like this and then this is the whole thing. So you have a cord and then you have the push and pull thing. And then this is the power. You have one, two, three, four on the settings. You guys can zoom in you there, right there. So we're just gonna uncord this and we're gonna try to see if we can curl my hair. Now, Dyson is expensive, guys. That's like $500, $600, and I do not have the audacity to go pay for that, even if it's on the Vibe sale. It wasn't very good on the Vibe sale. This one was originally $170, and I got it for like $115, so I did save something, but I've heard good reviews on this, and a lot of people love it, and a lot of people bought the Dyson, and then they end up returning it because they like this better. So this was something I just wanted to see and try out. This was a birthday present to myself. I finally got it after the fact, but I did buy this on my birthday, so. Okay. All right, so the hair is down and my hair does curl at night when it's wet because I do take a shower before I put my hair up for the night. So this is what my hair looks like when I just wanna put it up and not deal with it when it's wet. Take this brush, comb through the hair. I have a lot of knots, so. I mean, it has waves in it, which is always something I like when I get my hair down for the day. But most of the time, my hair is usually up. All right. Oh, see, here's a big knot. Okay. All right. This guy in. All right, so it's in. So you just push it up if you don't want to do it. Um, so settings are off, moderate temperature. So the setting levels are zero for off, one for moderate temperatures for gentle drying or styling. High temperature, two, for fast drying and styling, or three, the highest temperature for fast dry, drying and styling. So there's the changing the styling attachments and there's how to use the attachments. So the styling attachment is a spiral comb in, the spiral comb is for the hair curling purpose. I don't see. No. All right, so we're just gonna wing it. All right. So we're gonna put it on. So it's very loud. That's one. Two. Three. Okay, so I'm just gonna put this on and see what happens. And there will be music in the background for you guys. So we're just gonna take a piece of hair. 
I do have my hair clips. So we're just gonna take this piece of hair. We're just gonna hopefully So it did curl, not a whole lot, but it did curl. Very good. Okay, let's try the other side. Let's go to this side. Pick some hair up. I think we need to do it a little longer. So we just... <laughs> That is a curl. That is a curl. Now, I am not a person that curls my hair every day. So you people have to tell me if this is the right way. This is the right way or this is the right way. I don't know. I'm going to finish the rest of my hair off camera and I'm going to come back and give you my thoughts on this bad boy. Let's see if it can get through my entire head. Shall hey guys, I am back. My hair is as curled as it's going to get. My hair... I don't know, maybe I need to get a heat resistant thing, but here's the deal on the dryer. It curled really well, um, as well as it's gonna be. I did have to get a glove because it did get hot. So I got one of my gloves. Um, I'm gonna tell you right now, I do not curl my hair like on a regular basis. I literally curl my hair every once in a blue moon. Um, just because my hair is just so straight, it's not curly. You know, you can try the grimpers, of, but I really wanna try and get a, like a dupe for the Dyson. I couldn't fathom spending $500 on the Dyson. So I got this one. It's a Conrad 5-in-1. So it blow dries, it styles, and it's supposed to be a 5-in-1 hot air styler. So uh, this is what my hair looks. I feel like this side's more curlier than this side just because I'm right-handed and trying to do it on the left side of my head. It's weird, but I will have to try to get better at this. Um, it does probably take some practice, you know, you can't be as good as you, you can't be as good as Remy Ashton. That chick knows how to definitely curl her hair. Um, but I like the way it came out. It's very pretty. Definitely like these curls a little bit better, but I mean, I got to learn how to work with it because this is like, I'm not a, like really big into hair. I'm more into makeup. So here's my thoughts. I'm glad I spent a hundred dollars instead of five hundreds on the Dyson I couldn't fathom spending that much money, but I'm glad I got this for 110 bucks. Here's what the box looks like. And I will link down the brand that I got it from or where I got it from down below if you guys are interested. I don't know if it's still on sale anymore, but I will say that you definitely have to keep your arm up because your hair can get stuck in this vortex thingy. So definitely keep your arm up when you're curling and you go around with your hair. And I thought this thing was just going to suck your hair in and do it, but that would take too long. So I just kind of started curling my hair around it and dropping it down curling around it, dropping it down like this, and then curling it and then letting it go down. So that's what I did. It took literally maybe 30 minutes, but I mean, my curls aren't as bouncy as I would like just because I didn't, the heat started getting hot and I just, I didn't want to like burn my fingers or anything on camera. So I literally just kind of just went with like a light curl, not too lack, it's lackluster. It's not that great of curls. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, not that great, but I don't curl my hair on a daily basis. Now, a couple videos when I had short hair, I did curl my hair and I used to uh, straightener to curl my hair. That was great. But unfortunately that straightener is literally crap now. It does not work. <laughs> And his garbage. So I definitely needed to get something new and I didn't want to fathom going and buying a new straightener. So I decided to get this. I wanted to try the curl free all on camera and see what the deal is. And I'm really happy I did. I really do like this. Glad I spent 150 bucks versus 500. 
very happy with that. And I just, I think all overall, I'm gonna be really great. Get, get, I'm gonna be getting my money's worth out of this because I'm definitely gonna be curling my hair more. So as always guys, please subscribe to my channel, you lazy videos. And if you don't like me, I really don't care. This is what I like doing on my channel. So I will see you guys in the next one.